Okay, just got back from Mass, and yesterday we fixed the wall. Well, it's been fixed. We just put the final third sanding on the wall. That's all ready to be prepped and primed. And the whole room's going to get painted. The walls from there to there is nine and a half foot. So after 10 years, it needs a fresh coat of paint. I'm gonna go the same color, same theme. I'm not gonna paint up on the, I don't know what you call that. I'm gonna paint up on the tandem window, but not, not that. What is that called? Bulk? Feeling, whatever. Because from there to there is nine and a half foot. I don't know what the equation math is. Up to there is twelve and a half foot. So it's just and this this is you can't see it in this, but this is a different color. And then the flat part is a different color, and then the ceiling's a different color. So it doesn't need to be painted right now. Anyways, getting prep, getting everything done that you live with, and then go, oh, we're gonna sell the house, so now we need to we need to get things done. It's so equity in here. I, I forgot how big this room is once you take everything out. Oh, I should probably turn the lights on. Well, that didn't help. Maybe? <laughs> no. Yeah. Anyways, and then I'm going to paint the bed frame. Um... I haven't decided yet. Uh, I think maybe that color, that dresser that I posted on Facebook, I might do it in that silver. I'm not sure. But, um, yeah, that's what I'm doing this Sunday. There's the door out into the house. And then that is the bathroom. That's a disaster. And got the TV. We mounted the TV uh, early last spring. No, early last fall. Or early this fall. So I have to paint the thingies on both sides, but got that covered up. And this hole, actually, that door goes over that and it gets hinged. Um, that is for the outside shower. On the other side of this wall, there's an outside shower outside. And, um, cause we live out in the woods and there's no one around. Anyways, and that's for the plumbing for, show you my messy bathroom, um, for, my bathtub, which I have one of these containers down so I can go through it because all my containers go up there and they're numbered and then I have in a book, which is in there, that uh, so for like seasonal stuff or stuff you don't wear all the time, but oh yeah, everything is a mess, but it's all coming together. It's all good. But yep, the I measured the floor when I went to go get the paint and it's 300 square foot. And I told him that the walls were nine and a half foot tall, so he figured it out. So he's thinking in about three gallons. I don't think so, because it's already been painted once. It's been primed and painted once. Other than that area, I'll put some kills on it. So I just got two gallons. And I hope that I don't end up screwing myself on that. But with the slider, this is an eight foot slider, and that window is a five foot window. It looks smaller in here, but... Um, I, it takes up a lot of room. And then you got this door that goes in the open. And that door is an eight foot door. Um, so, yeah. And then you got the outside door. So, yeah. And this is where we're camping out. This is where we put everything. <laughs> this is where we've been sleeping in our living room. It's romantic and cozy. Say hi, honey. <laughs> He's eating his breakfast after mass. <laughs> Hey, hi, Annie. Eating flesh. He won't go vegetarian with me. But we're eating up. He's e he is eating up the rest of our pork we had left over from when we used to raise him. But i watching his TV. So that's what I'm doing on my Sunday. Have a good day. And don't forget, you're never too old to have a great childhood. Bye.